Hi folks, welcome to In Focus. I'm Frank Romer. In today's review slash demo, I'll be talking about the Q500 and the Q500 Plus Typhoon quadcopters, both made by a company called Unique. To begin with, I've been flying quadcopters now since 2012, and I can truly say that this aircraft is a pleasure to fly. It feels very stable and provides plenty of control and even confidence to the pilot, which is very important. The overall build quality is excellent. The included three axis gimbal with a high definition tilting camera and optimal ground control station with a real time video feed to this controller equate to a flight experience much better than what I expected, especially for under $1,200 for the entire kit. This is a very well designed aircraft, especially for someone like me who simply wants to capture smooth aerial videography and high quality pictures without having to build something from the ground up. So I've had an opportunity now to fly this aircraft many different times under many different conditions. And I've got to tell you that this is simple to use and quite capable of providing stunningly smooth, high quality video. For me though, the single most important feature about this investment is the quality of the video and pictures that this camera produces. Flight time was the second most important feature, which I will talk about in a few moments. Actually, there are many great features that I wanna share with you that you need to know about regarding this aircraft if you're thinking about buying a quadcopter. Not quite sure where to start, but I will do this. Let's talk about, or I'll talk to you about my top 10 features and we'll go from there. Number one, excellent video quality. Because this is really an investment for my company, the bottom line for me is the video quality, even the video codec, which I've got to look closely at. So I basically think of this as a flying camera. The CGO2 is the actual camera with an integrated three axis gimbal that yields smooth 1080 60p video and a .MP4 codec. Overall though, the integrated camera on the Q500 will yield beautiful, rich, vibrant color and detail, and I find it totally acceptable compared to any other sports action camera that I've been using. Although, lens distortion is apparent on my Q500 camera on the captured video files, and I'll talk about that in just a moment. All right, number two, high quality photo capability. The built-in 12 megapixel camera is capable of capturing stunning imagery at any altitude. I'm very pleased with the quality of the picture taking capability of this unit. Number three, long flight time. I absolutely needed more flight time out of my previous quadcopter and never really got that because I was averaging 12 to 15 minutes, which is not very good. With the Q500 and the included 5500 milliamp battery, I'm able to get 21 to 25 minutes of flight time. And Unique includes two batteries with your purchase. Now I'm gonna recommend that you get an additional two because like me, I do back-to-back -back projects. And if I only have two, sometimes I need more flight time, then I've got two more to utilize. And by the way, these batteries take about three hours to charge. Um, so if you do the math, having additional batteries just makes sense. Number four, real-time video feed to the controller. The included 10-channel ST10 ground station controller allows me to preview right on the controller what the camera sees on the aircraft. Now, there's a four and a half inch screen on the Q500 and a five and a half inch screen on the Q500 Plus controller. So pay attention to that. Now that just basically means that I don't need to carry around an additional smart device to see what the camera sees. Number five, camera trigger and control. The ground station has a start and stop trigger for both video and photo capture. This feature is such a convenience for many reasons. I can also tilt the camera for greater positioning while the aircraft is in flight. Number six, smooth, comfortable flight. I was very comfortable flying this aircraft from the get-go. I never felt like I was out of control while flying. The pitch, yaw, and roll are never too drastic, which typically leaves you with a nervous feeling inside, right? Uh, the controllers here on this unit are very conservative, which I'm actually good with because I'm not really planning on racing this unit in the near future. It offers smooth control, which yields smooth video. Number seven, real-time flight data. Boy, this is great. You've got, a, you've got so much real-time flight information in the palm of your hands. The ST10 ground station uh, is a virtual flight control center, complete with touchscreen capabilities. Uh, I get distance status, altitude status, latitude and longitude status, number of satellites connected status, aircraft battery status, Wi-Fi video link status, direction back home status, ground speed and feedback, so much more information. I'm very comfortable uh, flying this aircraft with this controller. Okay, number eight, build design. 
I'm very impressed with the quality and professional looking design of this aircraft. You can tell by the touch and by picking it up uh, that it's very durable and it has a solid construction to it. Overall, the appearance is very professional and I do appreciate that. It's impressive in person, by the way, and it looks um, very impressive while in the air as well. So um, not that that's the, a big deal, but to my clients while this is up in the air, or at least while I'm taking it out, it's impressive to them, uh, which says professional all the way. Number nine, flight modes. The ST-10 ground station allows the pilot to select from three flight modes, smart, angle, and home. Simply put, the smart mode is great for beginners and is designed for pilots with little or no flight experience. Angle mode is designed for experienced pilots who've flown before and are comfortable in the air. Home is an option that when selected, the aircraft will return and land from the very spot that it took off from. That's very convenient. Okay, finally, number 10, most important feature. Customer service and warranty from Unique are excellent. Although I had to swap out a battery due to a charger malfunction after about the first month of operation, Unique customer service made the replacement process seamless and was actually on par with the legendary Nordstrom level of customer service. So here's how it worked. I called Unique on a Monday. I had my replacement battery in my hands by Thursday. That is very impressive. Okay, so those are my top 10 features. But I do also want to say that I believe this aircraft is future-proof because unlike some other quadcopter aircraft that are out there, this camera unit here can be removed and replaced with ease uh, with any future camera that Unique creates. So when the 4K camera unit comes out from Unique, I'll be able to slide this camera off and slide that 4K camera right on here with ease. So, to me, that means future-proof, which is very important these days. I should also mention that when you purchase the Q500 Plus, you'll get an improved video experience from the included camera on that, on that aircraft, which also captures audio. The original Q500 camera does not capture audio, which is not a big deal. I don't need that loud noise anyway, but the Q500 Plus does capture audio. Although both capture the same video resolution at 1080 60p, you may experience a slight bump in overall video quality with the Q500 Plus. Also, the live feed, uh, the actual screen on the Q500 Plus controller is five and a half inches, the actual viewable area on the Q500, which is nice, or at least on that controller. With the Q500 Plus, you'll also receive a carrying case that will protect your aircraft, the controller, and the accessories. Also included with the purchase of a Q500 Plus is the Steady Grip, which is really nice. This accessory allows you to capture smooth, stabilized, creative shots with ease in your hand. You really get so much with your investment when you purchase the Q500 or the Q500 Plus. One additional item, I wish I could get some manual control of the integrated camera on the Q500. Auto mode is how the camera operates. Unfortunately, sometimes the video capture can be kind of hit and miss, depending on the surrounding conditions, cloudy, things like that. I do have a short wish list though. Uh, I wish that they would include manual ISO settings, uh, shutter speed control, and custom white balance options, but it's not a deal breaker. To summarize, um, I believe the Q500 and Q500 Plus is a, a solid investment and offers affordable and professional uh, aerial video and photo capabilities at an incredible price. With all the accessories that Unique includes with the purchase of your Q500 Plus or Q500, uh, this will be a very hard system to beat by any other manufacturer out there. So, uh, oh and by the way, based on my overall experience with the Q500, I am seriously considering investing in another one. So that alone should tell you that uh, based on my experience, I'm going to add another what I'm going to call aerial tool or from my professional video production. So other than that, I do appreciate you watching and happy flying.